Breaking news, Nigerians. Northern Group fires President Tinubu for appointing Yoruba people into key positions. <laughs> oh my God, these people, they are very, very funny. Hmm. So suddenly, they have gotten their voice. This is what we've been talking about. You people encourage this. When President, the US President, Muhammad Buhari was doing what he was doing, not in us, we are busy clapping. But the most, the most funny part of it is that with all the Jewish positions that was given to the Northerners, now then suffer so past self for that president, Muhammad Buhari Steno. Buhari don't already set him now. So you see him, Tinubu don't come, he don't follow in line. He don't follow in full step. After all, he said he's going to continue from where his principal stop, his predecessor. So why are they complaining? Make one not complain though. No. You people are busy playing politics of ethnic heart, politics of tribalism, nepotism, all of them bobori bo join. Now 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 don't suddenly get to na voice because not be not an a day position abi. <laughs> if Nigeria do not drop this. If Nigerians do not drop this tribalism, religion, religion, this country will not progress. This is what is holding Nigeria down to today. If this is not corrected, this is how this country will continue to suffer. During Muhammad Buhari's tenure, he was flexing, not on us everywhere. The not on us not complain, no, they don't say anything, they not talk. Now another person don't enter. They don't begin the complaint. Who na can done? Be coming down. As it is now, the game have started. Tinubu have started his own. You understand? As they gather all the Yoruba people now for all the positions. He has started it. He they play in own. Una, the the uh, Buari don't come play in own. Now this one na Tinubu time. So he don't they play in own. Una know what na go do. Make on sit down they watch. You understand? Because you guys were watching when Muhammad Buhari was doing what he's doing. You refuse to say the truth. Elderly people cannot speak the truth. Now, see where Nigeria is today. Nigeria is now nowhere to be found. Nigeria, where we say other African countries, they use and they proud. We are nowhere to be found because of evil people. Anybody when one will enter all their own is just for their own selfish benefits. If they play your own game, so make one sit down and watch them. Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. President Bola Tinubu has been charged with nepotic practices by the Ariwa Economic forum aef for selecting yorubas particularly Lagosians, to important positions the group ascertained that people from the southwest predominates in the banking and ict industries which are essential to the country's economic sources ibrahim dandakata the forum's chairman said we are afraid to remark that a situation where the appointees in critical economic sectors are not only from the southwest but also tied to the Lagos as it shows a planned urbanization and legalization of the politics. On Wednesday, he spoke at a news conference held in Abuja by the forum to express his displeasure with what appeared to be nepotic appointees by Mr. Tinubu. The interim CBN governor, Shonibu, and the finance minister, Wale Idom, are both from the southwest, according to Mr. Dandakata, who acknowledged that the pair were suitable for the jobs. The minister of communications, innovation, and the digital economy 
Mr. Bozo, eh, Bosu Tijani, as well as the House of Representatives, Honorable Ade DJ, Ola DJ, and the Chairman of the Senate Committee on Information and Communications Technology, Senator Afalobi, are all from the Southwest, he said. He explained that despite their contribution to the president's victory in the general election, they not remained excluded from the banking and ICT industries. President Bola Tinubu has a responsibility to not only be fair to all parts of the country, but also to be seen to be fair to all parts and said, to, to be fair to all parts, please pardon me, said Mr. Dan Dakata as a patriotic, refined statement who won a credible national mandate on February 25th, 2023. The President Bola Tinubu has a duty to be fair to all parts, he stated. Mr. Dan Dakata further noted that the new administration has replaced certain key government agencies, the chief executives who had previously been notanous with Lagosians. Mr. President still has time to turn the corner and make the necessary decisions regarding incoming appointments. We expect President Tinubu to be fair, just and equitable in his decisions, not only because the Northerners overwhelmingly voted for him, but also because that is the right thing to do, added Mr. Dan Dakata. You see, when we are saying that <laughs> tribalism, we finish Nigeria, he be like the person they just talk. You see, he's just trying to protect his own side. He mentioned Southwest. He did not mention South South. He did not mention Southeast. So everybody, when they come, you they drag your own. This is really very, very danger. It's danger. Nigeria is gradually fading out. May God have mercy on us. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you.